everyone, I'm going to do a haul video today. I'm sorry if you can hear um, the lawnmower, I think my dad's just started it. I'm going to shut my window, hold on a second. A little quieter. Um, but yeah, I'm going to do a haul video now. Um, it's not much, it's just a little few bits and bobs that I've picked up in the last couple of weeks. Um, I recently went on holiday to Cornwall for a week, so I haven't, that's why I haven't like put up a video in a while. Um, so yeah, got a bit of a tan, you can't really tell because I'm really pale, but I got a bit of a tan. Um, so yeah, I didn't actually buy anything on holiday, but I um, bought a few things before and after. So let me get started. Um, before I went on holiday, I went to, let me see if I can find the poster. I went to a vintage fair in Leicester, Leicester Cathedral, um, and that was on Saturday the 16th of July. And I think there's another one. Yeah, there's another one in Leicester on Saturday the 29th of October, um, which is quite cool. My boyfriend lives near Leicester, so that's why I ended up going. Um, and I got this ring. And this necklace. Now, I will try and see if I've got the um, company's name. Here we go. The Prettiest Things Kitsch and Vintage Style Jewellery. Uh, the prettiest things .co .uk. and they do some really lovely um, pieces like that and for quite reasonable I think this was like two pounds and this was like 450 so that's pretty decent um, if you ask me uh, so yes that's what I got from there um, charity shops I got this cardigan just a um, leopard print cardigan uh, I can't remember where it was from, but I think it was £3. So I got that from a charity shop. I got this top, but it's too small. I stupidly bought it in a size smaller, thinking it would fit me, and it doesn't. Um, so yeah, it's this top. I got it for £3, so I'm not like that annoyed because three pounds goes to charity so you know I haven't lost anything so it's all right. I'll just have to get rid of it somehow. Um, I thought it was really pretty but it doesn't fit me sadly. I think that's all my charity shop finds. I haven't done much charity shop shopping recently but I did find these amazing shoes in New Look. Now I can't really walk in heels but I'm trying to get used to it to get my feet break into them and these were £6 from New Look and I absolutely love them they are really bright and colourful and actually quite comfortable even though I've already fallen over in them but yeah I like those talking about falling over um, as some of you may know I have etme and fibromyalgia so I have to use a stick um, sometimes and um, I left my usual stick at my boyfriend's house so um, I bought a new one and it's it's a collapsible one so I, I put it in my handbag and then when I need it I take it out and it's got these like flowers on I got it from like some cheap discount store um, but it's actually quite sturdy so I was pretty pleased with that I think it's like 2 99 so whereas my other one was from um, a disabled shop and it was like a tenner so yes um, this was an 8 with that discount store, Discount UK, and I got some hair dye, because I'm going back um, to black hair, um, I'm going to be doing the, this whole purple messy bit, um, black and keeping a pink bit in my fringe, so I bought two black hair dyes, and some bleach to do um, 
I'm already doing my pink and my root for my pink bit, so. Oh, and I also bought some dressings because um, I fell up the stairs at a train station and cut over my knee, so I need these. Oh, and I also got Sun Silk Care and Repair Leave In Cream, so hopefully that will restore some of the restore my hair a bit because it's quite damaged at the moment. Um, what else have we got? I bought the latest at, <coughs> excuse me, Vintage Life magazine that came out a few days ago. Um, in Sainsbury's they have this um, sort of, what do you call it, a brand called Dirty Works. Um, it's sort of like, um, what do I like, soap and glory, but cheaper, so um, I went there today and got this anti-cellulite gel, ditch the dimples, um, and I think that was on sale for £3.99, because I usually get, um, last time I got Ferminator from soap and glory and that was like £10, so I thought I'd try this one. And I got the um, Buff Your Stuff Body Scrub, because I love um, body scrubs. So that was good. Uh, from Primark, I got this, what do you call them, Bando Tops. Um, and it was reduced to a pound. I thought that would be nice under like sheer shirts and stuff. And then... From Boots, I got a Aussie Three Minute Miracle Colour Deep Treatment to help my hair. Um, from the sort of alternative shop in Wrexham where I live, I got um, a Flamingo Pink. I've never used Flamingo Pink before by um, Directions. I usually use Directions, but I've never used this one, so exciting stuff. The last two things are two clothing items. The first one is this which I bought off boohoo.com and it is the Rebecca High Waisted Button Front Shorts. They look like this and they've got a side zip. They don't fit exactly how I want them to fit but I might um, put a few darts in them and hopefully they'll fit like I want them. They're really comfortable, stretchy, and um, they go above the belly button, and I quite like that, so I think these are £15. And then the last thing I bought, <coughs> excuse me, I've got a cranky voice, um, is this dress from H&M, and it was £7. Um, and I was thinking the other day, I don't actually own, like, a pro just a basic black dress. So I got this... Um, v-neck, black dress, cinched in waist and then flares out, probably hits me. Um, so yeah, I thought that would be quite nice. Um, it would look nice with these shoes but um, I will only wear these shoes if I go out anywhere fancy because I'm not walking around in these all day so yes. Oh, one more thing, sorry. Um, on eBay, a couple of weeks ago, I bought a um, hot roller set. There we go. That's what I did my hair in yesterday. It's fallen out a bit now. But, um, yeah, eBay, I think they're like £8. Um, what is it? Beedle Sassu. Um, so, that's awesome. They work. Love eBay. Um, so, yeah. Um, that's my haul. Um, it's a bit all over the place, I'm sorry about that, um, but thank you for watching and I will make another video soon, um, yes, so thank you for watching, bye bye.